what is the difference between LWC and Aura? Both are component, yes. Both are Lightning compatible, yes. The first difference is that Lightning use Aura framework, whereas LWC use HTML and DOM framework. Whereas HTML, whereas HTML, whereas LWC is using HTML and or DOM and Java framework, meaning it's same. HTML means DOM, DOM and Java framework, right? Clear? Web component is ECMA7 compatible. Whereas Lightning Aura is ECMA5. What are these? These are ECMA or standard, web standard for a component. Any web component has to follow certain standard guidelines. ECMA has seven is the highest guidelines. Something like BS3 engine, BS4 engine, BS6 engine now, Bharat Euro 6 engine pollution emission emission standard how much your vehicle is making the pollution right these are compared with the pollution emission standard all these standards are given by the ministry of environmental right environment ministry gives that hence here also by taking the needs of all the customers consumers by looking at the bandwidth, the speed of the internet, by looking at the usability of internet, there is a commission, a European commission, right, which manage or maintains standard of all web pages, web components. That union or that organization is called, right, ECMA. ECMA is the, right, it's a manufacturer's organization. This organization defines guidelines for a web component as per the seventh guidelines right lwc falls on the seventh guidelines seventh guidelines it fall it's an ecma 7 compatible that means highest in standard whereas lightning component is ecma 5 compatible that means there's a lot of improvement to be done on that now what is this ecma 7 Right. In the ECMA 7, it talks about every web component should have four elements. What are those? Right. Custom element. Right. It should consist of custom elements, templates, shadow DOM, module. Right. Write down. LWC. LWC consists of number one, template custom elements shadow dom module right now what are each let's understand because in the interview they will ask you what is the shadow dom right first custom element right this is the foundation or structure or design of the component write down custom element this is a structure right foundation or design of the element custom element is nothing but the structure right the design right the foundation of the custom element perfect next right shadow dom what is a shadow dom right Shadow DOM is nothing but an encapsulation process. Shadow DOM is nothing but it is encapsulation process of all your designing. All your designing, right? Your design plus style combined together is called Shadow DOM. Design plus style combined together is called Shadow DOM. Design plus style 
combined together is called shadow dom is called shadow dom right it is a process of encapsulation what is an encapsulation it's nothing but capsuling what is a capsule you know that medicine can be given in three ways liquid orally whenever you can't drink a liquid it's very bitter or the chemical will react it's very bitter then we make tablets if the tablet might react with the air or with the water then they put inside the capsule plastic capsule they put the medicine inside the capsule so that that doesn't react with the air water outside environment they are well protected this protection is called capsulation this protection of the inside element or the inside component or the inside you know uh, matter with a border or a boundary we call them as encapsulation right shadow dom is nothing but it is combining both design and styles together encapsulated right and then process we call them as shadow dom next html template html template right what is an html template right this is the designing right this is the designing part of lightning web component html template is the de designing right designing part of lightning web component right on it's a designing part next yes